What's up everybody? Welcome back to another Last Wraps Baseball video card break. And today it's our final day of Epic. And the Epic cards are from Japan. And um, yeah, this is our first crack at uh, Epic in a couple of years. And so uh, hopefully uh, you folks will enjoy the video. Um, so far our results have been I'd say uh, average at best. We haven't really pulled any fire, no numbered cards, uh, no relics. Um, so it's been, from that standpoint, kind of a downer. But uh, we have started to pull some of the stars from the Japanese League and some of the young rookies. So hopefully we can continue our um, our quest today by getting some more things to, to, to bounty up our, our haul that we've had. So without further ado, uh, we're going to crack it open. And uh, we have noticed that the it is Nippon Ham Fighters usually lead off the packs. And then they're followed by Rakuten Eagles, then by Yamuri Giants, by Hiroshima Toyo Carp. Uh, and then uh, your Cult Swallows are always at the back and everybody else in between. And you get one card per team, one card per team. And so here we are with an Nippon Ham Fighter. Shingo Usami to lead it off. And now a Rakuten Eagle will be... A rookie card of Ryota Takenaka, and he's followed by a Yumuri Giant of uh, Nobutaka Imamura, and he's followed by a Hiroshima Carp, rookie card of Yuya Nirasawa. And so, uh, as we talked about the pitcher, Masamoto, um, Nirasawa is, um, is also a fairly popular uh, young carp uh, that they have right now, so it'll be interesting to keep an eye on this guy. Our next one up, we have an Edwin Escobar of the Yokohama Da Bay Stars. And um, something that you'll notice with Yokohama in particular is they have a real affection to the Latin players. A lot of Latin flavor in Yokohama uh, with the players in their, uh, on their team. And um, I don't know if that's because of the manager, Alex Ramirez, but uh, certainly uh, that plays a role, I'm sure. There's Atsuki Tanichi for the uh, Chibalote Marines in a rainbow uh, foil uh, parallel card. Kazumasa Yoshida for the Oryx Buffaloes. I don't know what's in the background there, where they're at. It's uh, you've got mountains and you got a, you got uh, it's an interesting uh, interesting backdrop. Uh, most of the cards, it's you know guys are hitting. This must be a spring training picture from somewhere. I don't know where they're at. Maybe in Okinawa or, or wherever. I know some of the the teams will go and train there. Um, here is Yuito Mori, a uh, pitcher for the SoftBank Hawks. He has now sort of uh, gone out of the eighth inning role. He's kind of their closer now. Uh, so Dennis Safrady, who was a longtime Fukuoka pitcher, um, had some shoulder issues and some struggles, and he's still with the club. But this guy here has sort of assumed the role as the closer now. And I've seen this guy before. That's uh, Hatsu, uh, Hatsuhiko uh, Tsuji, and he is the manager for the... Uh, the Cebu Lions, Hiroshi Suzuki for the Chinichi Dragons, and then you have Shun Takayama, outfielder for the Hanshin Tigers, and then our last card is Yasutaka Shimoi for the Occult Swallows, and then we're back to our Ham Fighter to lead it off. Three packs to go, still no fire, um, and it's not looking promising either. <laughs> it's uh, three packs left, and and, you know, we're getting these, uh, and, and no numbered cards that I know of. As I said, I'm going to go back through these and take a look again, but I, I don't think we've even got any numbered parallels in this. Um, so, yeah, is it disappointing? Um, yeah, maybe. <laughs> maybe, I don't know. Well, I guess we'll find out here in, in a bit. Maybe it's got some uh, comeback method to it. Taishi Ota for the uh, Ham Fighters leads it off, and our Rakuten Eagle card is going to be Yuhei Takanashi. Followed by our Yamuri Giant of pitcher uh, Haruto Inoue. And again, I'm now uh, going to be the president of the Haruto Inoue fan club. I think that's at least the second card I've seen, if, if not the third. And so now what do we have for the carp? And the carp we have Tomohiro Abe. Or Havi, depending on how you say it. And then we have Toshiro Miyazaki for the uh, Yokama Danabe Stars. And our rainbow card is going to be a QG Fujikawa card from the Hanshin Tigers. And then we have Hirotoshi Masui for the, uh, for the Oryx Buffaloes. And then a Hiroshi Kaino for the Fukuoka SoftBank Hawks. Chibalote Marine infielder Hisanori Asuda. 
And he is followed up by Dan Visayedo of the Chinichi Dragons. Chinichi, there he is, Dan Visayedo. And uh, the Cebu Lions, we have Katsunori uh, Harai. And then we have the Occult Swallow. We have Tomotaka Sakaguchi. Tomotaka Sakaguchi. So, two packs left. No fire. And at this point, you know what? I'd be disappointed if we did get fire because, you know, all this build up for nothing and then to get fire at the end, you know, that would, it's a good drama. But uh, at this point, we would be able to get it out of our way earlier. And probably it'll be a mascot relic card with a piece of the mascot in it. I can just, I can just see it coming now. Numbered mascot card. Any thick cards in this in the middle? No, no, not yet. And there is uh, the king, Taiwanese outfielder Po Jung Wang, the king. He's not hitting like the king. Last time I looked, he was batting 097, so he's got his struggles to sort out uh, there. And then we have a Takahiro Norimoto, a Rakuten Eagle pitcher. And he is followed by Kota Nakagawa. And there's a crowd in the background over there. I don't know if he's warming up in the bullpen and... But uh, somebody's got a mask on. I wonder if that's uh, or if that's just because of uh, their normal um, uh, culture. When people are sick, they will wear a mask regardless. And then we have Takiro Imamura, cart pitcher. And we are followed by Takahiro Ishikawa. Takahiro Ishikawa. And then our next one is, is we've got, uh, there's our sidewinder again, Ray, with that funny hand grip. Ray Takahashi. Uh, and a rainbow foil. And then we have a Shuhei Fukuda card of the Oryx Buffaloes. There's Ernesto Maya. Ernesto Maya, he's getting himself sorted out. He's down on the farm right now. He's had some decent years, number of years playing in Japan, and so he's getting himself ready to line up right now. The only import batter in the lineup that the Lions have is Corey Spangenberg. We haven't seen a Spangenberg yet, and we got one pack to do it in. And there's a Chiba Lote Marine, Kazuya Ojima. And then we have a Yuya Gunji for the Chinichi Dragons. And then we have a Ippi Ogawa for the Hanshin Tigers. And last but not least in this pack is Hiroki Onishi, the Occult Swallows rookie. And there, of course, is the king, Po Jung Wang, or Wang Po Jung, depending upon where you're from, how you may say it. But he doesn't hit like the king right now. And um, there's a lot of barking going on about a Taiwanese player in uh, the Cleveland Indian organization. But um, I'll believe it when I see it, if he can get to the big league level and show us that he can produce and play. Um, but we'll, uh, we'll find out in a couple of years how that plays out. So our last pack, again, is there any fire? Doesn't look like it. Uh, but there is consistency, and we have Kinsuke Kondo. Upon Ham Fighter on the top. Upon Ham Fighter followed by our Rakuten Eagle, which would be Ryota Ishibashi. And then, of course, we have a Shunta Tanaka for the uh, Yamuri Giants. And why can't we get doubles of the cart players? They seem to be uh, popular. And so there's Ryui Matsuyama. And if it is a double, it's not the double that we want. Uh, and then we have a Koki Matsuoka. So our card with fire will normally be the next card in the pack. And it doesn't look like it's fire. It looks like a rainbow foil again. And that would be Yasuyuki Yamazaki, pitcher for the Yokamada Bay Stars. And then we have Masahiro uh, Nishino. Actually, Nishino looks like he's getting uh, he's in the cage getting some BP. Arata Shino, a pitcher for the Fukuoka SoftBank Hawks. And then we have uh, Chihaya Suzaki for the Chibalote Marines. Yuki Okabayashi, a outfielder, rookie outfielder for the Chinichi Dragons. Hanshin Tiger, pitcher uh, Hiroto uh, Saaki. Maybe maybe if we could get somebody for the Swallows that I'd be interested in would be Alicides Escobar. We got one in the... Uh, EBM, are we going to get Alicides Escobar in here? And the answer is no. We got a Yugo Umeno as our last card in the break. Well, everybody, that's it for our Japanese baseball and it for our NPB uh, 2020 Epic. And I can say this, we are probably not going to order another 2020 epic main set box again this year um now i remember a couple years ago why i didn't buy another box last year um 
I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope it's different. I hope uh, you got a kick out of it. And as much as we did doing it, or at least I did doing it. And so if you're interested, uh, please leave a comment. If you want to know more, you want to know anything about this, these things, let us know what you like better. Do you like the BBMs or do you like the Epics? Um, you know, give us your thoughts and uh, hopefully, uh, hopefully we'll see you again. If you like the video, be sure to give us a thumbs up. If you're new, hit the subscribe button. But once again, you've watched another Last Drops Baseball video production. Arigato gozaimasu. Thank you everybody for stopping by. Have a good day.